Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 5th of December 2024. I hope you are keeping well. It's 8, just gone 8 p.m. here in Thailand. I was waiting to see if I was going to get a, a notification for evening stuff. Uh, I've done, had one early evening job but I was waiting for another one. It looks like it's not going to arrive now. It's a bit late, I think. Don't think the work will be coming, so I shall play a game of Sudoku instead. What's going on in the world? Uh, South Korea's President Yoon uh, is facing impeachment on Saturday, uh, an impeachment de debate, but it looks like his party, the ruling party, uh, are taking a leaf out of the Republican U.S. Republican playbook and decided they're not going to they're not going to impeach him. Um, I have a feeling that uh, that might hit them electorally next time, if there is still democracy by the time <laughs> they get around to having a next, the next election. I have a feeling people will not forget that uh, in South Korea, and I have a feeling they're going to be hit hard and probably lose their majority next time. But it's just a feeling, uh, and I'm very often wrong about politics, as we know. Not wrong in my opinions, just wrong in my predictions. <laughs> Whoever thinks that they're wrong in their opinions, none of us, right? <laughs> uh, shall we get on with the Los Angeles Times expert level Sudoku puzzle? Why not, I hear you say. Okay then, let's start with nines blocking across here and down here and giving me a nine in this square, like so. And it looks like we've got nine blocking this square down here, down here, down here, down here, and we get another nine. One blocking across here and one down here puts one into one of these two squares. Let's go back in the right direction. And then a one down here. Five and six up here, five and six across there in our New York Times style of puzzle trick. We've got a pair of five and six in these two squares. These squares are not five or six. They must be two, seven, eight. We've got eight blocking down here. Here's the Eight and this will be two and seven. Seven blocking here. There's the seven. There's the two. One blocks this square. Oh no, sorry. I thought I needed a one that's up there. Oops. Nearly got it wrong. Don't worry about it. No action taken. Missing digits are in fact three and what is the missing number? Four. So four blocking there. There we go. Four up there. Three down there. Missing in this block at the bottom is um, 279. We've got nines over here. We've got sevens. There. Ah, sevens. Seven blocking across here. So seven like this, seven across here. That will give us seven in that square. Seven up here, seven across there, and across there means this is a seven. Uh, two, I can see missing from this row immediately without even looking for the other number. Let's put the two in. Now let's look for the other number. The other number is four. Uh, 
Oh no. No, that's not true. Six blocking across here will give me six here. Um, two blocking this square here. We need a two in this row. It's got to go there. The last number for this row is a three. Three blocking down there. There's a three. There's a five. Uh, I think we're looking for one, two, eight, nine in this row. One, two, one, two, eight, nine. One, two, eight, nine. Yes, we are. We've got one, nine, and two here, so that's going to be the eight, which will give me eights like that. Three and four are in this block, so can't be in these two squares, but we need three and four in this column, so three and four have to be in those two squares there. That's a pair of three and four, which makes this five and six. Um, doesn't do anything for the fives for me, because I already know about the fives. I already know the fives are like this. And now, how about the sixes hmm. did I just put something else there I did, I put eights there. Okay, yeah, we had eight blocking up here and eights across here. Eight blocking down, so we end up with eight there. And then we've got six up here. Uh, sorry, five and six in those squares, right? Because we've got three and four down there. So six blocking down here, six blocking up here. So that's a pair of eight and six. Okay, so when the one blocks down here, one is in one of these two squares blocking down and one across here, that will give me a one there. Um, six and eight, so this is in fact one, three and four, so threes will be there. Fours, I have no idea. So we will have two nine there, two nine there. This is not two or nine but it could be three or four couldn't it so there's no unique rectangle there
Uh, if this is 6 and 8, I should look at these squares as well, shouldn't I? This is 6 and 8. So, missing numbers in this column are 2. There's 2 blocking there, so there's 2. This is 6 and 8. That's got to be something else. 9. Let's go through the digits bit by bit, shall we? Uh, we've got one and three across here. We've got one and three up there. So we've got a pair of one and three in those squares like so. These squares are not one or three. There must be two, five, seven. Uh, Two's there or there. Five, seven, still no I Oh, no, fives are here. Seven, I don't know. Okay. Two across here, two down, two up. So I think this is a pair of 3 and 6, isn't it? We've got 3 and 6 across the top, 3 and 6 up here, 3 and 6 up there. Yeah, that is a pair of 3 and 6. So what can we get from that? Anything about the 1s? 3 squares for 1s. Uh, yes, we can get the 4. 4 across here, 4 across there. There is the 4. Okay. Uh, Alright, let's try again. So what did I say? 3 and 6 in those squares. Um, so now, uh, when the 1 blocks across there, now 1 is in one of these two squares. So 1 blocking across, 1 across there, and 1 up there. That means that is a 1. Okay, now I, this was 3, wasn't it? We got 3 up here, yeah, 3 across there. There is our 3. Three this way, three that way. There's our three, and we know this is a six. Six across here and across there and up there. That gives us six in that square. Five blocking this square in this row. There's the five back over here for the seven. Uh, Two blocks across here, that will give us two in that square. Two blocking up there, that's two. Down at the bottom is seven. This is a nine. Uh, seven still needed up there. Seven across, seven up here. Seven is our first completed digit. It's taken a long time to get there, but there you go. Seven's out of the way now. There's one empty square down here. Let's have a look at that. That's a nine, I think. That's finished as well. Missing from here, what, three, four? 
no help on that just yet. Uh, no five six right up here. This must be something here. Yeah, one blocking across there. There's a one. One down here. One up there. There is a one. One across there. One down. One up. Should finish the ones. Yes. Last number to place here. Um, six. No, eight. I think. had six and eight there didn't we so eight across there there's the eight there's the six six blocking across here put six in that square this is a five five back that way there's a five here's a four four across there there's a four this is a three three to the bottom puts three here this is four the last number two place here is a five uh what are we looking for two no not two what's the last numbers up here uh, five, five blocking up there. There's the five, and this is an eight. Okay, eight across there. That gives me eight there, and the last number is two. That's a much easier puzzle than recently, but took a little bit of thought anyway. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you another time. Bye bye.